Shinola haters, cover your ears and eyes. We've got a doozy for you today. Welcome back to the channel for Right Time Watches here in Denver, Colorado. The watch we're looking at today comes from Shinola, one of our most controversial brands. But the watch we're looking at really has a lot of interesting features to it, and I'm excited to share it with all of you. But before we do all that, we'll invite you to subscribe to the channel so you catch all of our upcoming videos on awesome watches like this one. This cool watch comes in a fantastic box set with a book explaining the history behind the name The White Hurricane. The watch is inspired by a storm, a Great Lakes storm in 1913 that carried the same name. But before we do that, let's see the specs. This watch is large at 48 millimeters in diameter with a 52.8 millimeter lug to lug. It's 13 and a half millimeters thick and it's powered by a Shinola assembled Swiss quartz. Aside from the design with the beautiful clean white dial and a nice accented black bezel, there are a lot of things I really like about this watch. Number one being that it's got a movement with Argonite there on the dial. That means this was hand assembled in the Detroit facility made from a Swiss movement. Obviously, this is a chronograph movement, and as such, it's highly functional. You operate the chronograph in standard fashion using this top pusher here on the right to start timing. You can see that center second starts ticking away. You stop using that same upper pusher, and using this lower pusher, you can reset the chronograph. In something a little bit less common to Shinola, they've made this watch in all titanium, including the bracelet and case. It's got a lovely matte texture to it, and really looks fantastic. It's got a slightly domed sapphire crystal over top of this beautiful white dial, and overall is built to last. I really like the way this functions, as we've got a dive timing bezel here in addition to the chronograph, making this an extremely useful watch. The action feels pretty good, and the alignment is also quite nice. Once again, I'm blown away by the bracelet work here from Shinola. It's a fantastic satin three-link design made in all titanium with an expertly milled butterfly deployant clasp here on the underside. This bracelet feels very sturdy, even with the titanium construction. The case back has a familiar Shinola stamp on it, which is always a nice added detail. The reminder of the Detroit origins is always fun, as it's great to support an American company. People are often critical of the large nature of Shinola watches, and at 48mm this is a big one, but you'll see that the lug to lug measurement is just over 52 and makes this wearable if you've got a big wrist like my own. My wrist is 8 inches and this one feels right at home, especially since it's light titanium. And now onto my favorite feature of this watch, it's got a fully loomed dial. I always think this is so much fun, especially if you're a loom nut like we are here at right time. Shinola has become a brand that's easy to pick on, but really doesn't deserve a lot of the criticism that it gets. They make well-made wristwatches, albeit most of them with quartz movements, but they are hand-finished in Detroit. I appreciate what they're doing, and I think this watch is actually quite cool, and something I would definitely wear. And as an added bonus, you get an additional black rubber strap, which is easy to interchange with the quick change system. Whether you love or hate the brand, this watch really is quite interesting, and it's got a couple of features that really make it stand apart from the pack. The titanium construction and the full loom dial are just fantastic, and really fun at this price point. If you'd like to purchase this watch or any of our others, please visit us at righttime.com or give us a call. We're always happy to help. As always, thank you so much for stopping by, and we'll see you next time at Right Time.